Hey what's up guys, Scoutviv here and welcome to this Alexis Sanchez review. It's taken me this long to actually pick him up, I can't believe it either, but I eventually have, he's currently going for around 50k and as you can see from his card stats, they're looking pretty damn nice for that 88 pace, 87 dribbling and 82 shooting and in 6 games for me, he scored 7 times and got 4 assists. 7 goals in 6 games for a winger this year is very good in my opinion because I just find that wingers aren't as effective as they were last year but um, I think that's down to his physical stats because he's only got 59 strength in game but on the ball he is very very strong and you'll see that in the clips because ball control and dribbling in general is just ridiculous so let's go have a look at the in game stats now as you can see acceleration sprint speed very very high but only 59 strength Fair enough, he's got his six balance, but he just like hands people off. He stays on the ball, really good ball control, and he stays on the ball very, very well. Uh, the strength to me it was a lie. The in-game stats are a lie in that term because, um, as I say, very, very strong in-game for me. Uh, finishing very good, 86. He's also got a clinical finisher trait, which is absolutely awesome, and 81 shot power. Which once again, um, I disagree with that too much. His shots are very, very powerful in game. Three star weak foot, I do like to have four or five star weak foot on my wingers just because it's really good for cutting his side on each foot, but um, he did a good job with his right foot nevertheless. But as you're going to see from the clips, his dribbling and ball control are just insane. Look how close the ball stays to him. The defence can't get near it and he finishes very, very well past Joe Hart. And he does this on numerous occasions, just gets down the wing because his dribbling's really good, cuts inside and finishes very nicely. His crossing and passing for a winger are very, very good, really effective. His crossing is very accurate to be honest. You'll see that in a few upcoming clips. But look at this ball control. Cuts inside, very quick defence, uh, just all the way out, and then cuts back inside, tricks the defence. He can't get near it. Look at that strength. He stayed on his feet with his good balance and has the strength to keep running at the ball and puts in the back of the net with that shot power. As I've said, some of them in give stats don't seem to right to me. Makes a decent little run inside here and finishes very nicely past the goalkeeper. He does make... Uh, some good runs but I will say this sometimes he doesn't bother he is quite lazy when it comes to running and sometimes his positioning does let him down but look at that he's got strength and balance to stay on his feet there shoves off Felipe Luis cuts inside with a little scoop and uh, finishes very nicely past the goalkeeper that was a really nice goal to be honest but that's what he's all about if you want, if you want a winger that you want to cut inside with this is the guy for you because he's got the pace he's got the dribbling the ball controls cut inside and he can finish very very well one thing I did forget to mention is tackling He's actually really, really good defensively. I, don't, I know he doesn't have his high high work rates anymore, but he's one of the wingers that I've found that's really effective to tackle with. The one negative I found with him was sometimes he's out of position, which is quite annoying. But other than that, if you want a winger to cut inside and shoot with for a Premier League player, this is the guy, and I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. Anyway, guys, that is my review of Alexis Sanchez. If you have enjoyed, remember to leave a like. Remember to check out this morning's upload. Have a very good day. Comment below who you'd like to do next. Adios.